In ancient Korea, the burial methods for children were different from adults. Because of their young age, they were not recognized as members of the family. If they died unexpectedly, they couldn't be buried in the ancestral grave. Instead, their bodies were placed in jars and hung on some large trees. Lucy and Jack arrived at the location recorded in Lucy's father's notes. But that place had already been renamed. After multiple inquiries, they finally found an old man named David who knew about it. When David saw the map, he immediately said that it was the location of the sacred tree. His brother's family used to live nearby, so they had a deep impression of the place. However, the sacred tree was also known as the suicide tree in the area. Many people hand themselves on that tree, but the city underwent redevelopment 10 years ago, and the area had already been leveled. Lucy showed David her father's photo on her phone, and David recognized him. When David's brother was alive, he often saw him and had a good relationship with him.